Welcome back to Political Empire. This is Jeff Horseman with the Press Enterprise and PE.com. The Inland Congressional delegations had most of August off, and reporter Jim Miller is here to talk about how they spent their break. So, Jim, I understand our representatives took kind of different approaches to the August recess. Yes, they did. You know, they they had this this month away from Washington to, uh, you know, uh, take some trips, uh, reach maybe reconnect with constituents, visit some uh, from some local businesses. And, uh, you know, pretty much what they did uh, ran the gamut. You had Congressman Duncan Hunter, who represents uh, uh, the Temecula area, uh, areas, as well as a lot of San Diego County. He went all the way over to, to on a fact-finding mission to the Jordan-Syrian uh, border. The uh, Syrian border. Uh, you had uh, Congressman Mark Chicano, uh, Riverside Marina Valley District, making the rounds of, uh, of uh, uh, local businesses. Uh, a couple, uh, Takano and uh, other Democratic uh, lawmakers uh, held uh, town hall meetings, or what they called uh, town hall meetings to talk about the onset of the, uh, of the Affordable Care Act. All right. Well, you mentioned town hall meetings, but I understand they're maybe not as common as they were a few years ago. No, they don't seem to be. And, and, and it's not just in our area. It seems uh, it's kind of a nationwide phenomenon. And it, it seems, you know, it, it maybe has its roots in the uh, recess from four years ago in 2009 when uh, lots of members uh, came home for August recess and, and were greeted by a you know, very... Uh, uh, you know, loud and, and unhappy uh, town hall meetings from from people who who were opposed to you know the stimulus plan, uh, the, the health care uh, legislation, and it got you know got it, you know some lawmakers you know, pretty much had to escape through a back door, and you know, and in an age of smartphones and iPads, where where, where everything can can be uploaded to the internet you know, within minutes of a, of a perhaps embarrassing uh, uh, town hall meeting, it seems like uh, you know, some lawmakers are trying to avoid those and instead, you know, doing these uh, invitation-only events or organizing telephone town halls where they can kind of select the audience. All right. Well, thank you very much for your insight, Jim. We appreciate it. And thank you for watching Political Empire. We'll see you next time.